Hey there, everybody. Wow, looking at that last video, the video was kind of choppy. I've made a few adjustments to my settings. Hopefully this one will be a little bit better. Anyway, I got thinking about what I said earlier about uh, the advanced exam and whether I'd want to do it, what would uh, get me to do it. <sighs> okay, I'm a nerd. I'm going to keep studying. I'm probably going to go for the exam. Uh, it's the flight review and the cost of a flight review that uh, is sort of holding me back from wanting to do the, that. I mean, where I live in Pickering, Ontario, um, I'm kind of in a little bit of a space in between those bubbles on the uh, the map that shows where all the airports and heliports are and uh, so I, once summer hits once we're past june 1st with a basic i would be able to fly kind of close to home anyway um, although finding a suitable place to take off from and uh, not annoying anybody or uh, get people's uh, worries that I'm spying on my neighbors or something, then, uh, yeah, that might be a bit of a challenge. Um, but if I wanted to fly um, closer to Oshawa or further into Toronto, um, for whatever reason, um, maybe I want to get a a more aerial shot of uh, the Toronto skyline or something uh, then I would want to have an advanced uh, pilot certificate but uh, and, and you know it just makes things a little bit easier for traveling around um, with the uh, with the drone because there's a lot of places that uh, are in some of those controlled air spaces. So yeah, yeah, I probably will still study all the materials and I probably will still write the $10 online exam. The best quote I've seen though for the, the flight review is $200. And I can't see doing that unless, unless I had a, a plan to actually like really seriously go into business with this. Um, so like I said, you know, if say somebody I know that does real estate uh, came to me and asked for that, well, maybe, uh, probably in that sort of situation, it would quickly pay back, but uh, I don't know. It's not not a high priority for me. Um, but on the other hand, you know, continuing to learn more about airspace, more about um, what pilots of normal like manned aircraft have to go through that's interesting to me and I'm probably going to still keep on reading more, studying more, learning more, and that hopefully will make me a better pilot of the unmanned aircraft. Um, so yeah, possibly I think what I'm going to do with this channel then is uh, start doing a study along with me kind of thing. Um, approach it from a different topic each time and uh, see where that goes. Anyway, I thought I'd just say that, uh, let that thought out there, and uh, I don't know, see what people think, if anybody's interested in seeing that sort of thing. Remember, not an expert, right? Uh, I think it says right up there, beginner pilot. Uh, don't even actually have a real drone yet. <laughs> anyway, talk to you later.